Another story new tonight at 10. The first tri-state school has gone to all remote learning after a COVID-19 outbreak. This happening in the Bushnell Prairie City School District, where students were sent home to learn just a little more than a week into the school year. WGEM's Kara Biernat reports. Ben and Emma Hyde are learning from home tonight. We were notified there was a outbreak in the high school, and so everybody then went to e-learning full-time. Remote learning is the new normal for all students in the Bushnell Prairie City School District. This after the school district's Facebook page reported a COVID-19 outbreak forcing all students to go remote. I think it was good to stop you know, any further outbreak. BPC parent Rachel Hyde says remote learning at her house is off to a good start. It's a lot more um, organized and very well planned um, for my kids and so They've been doing good. We're learning on the couch and we're learning at the kitchen table or dining room. However, it does come with challenges as her students learn for two hours a day at daycare. Last night we were doing homework and she hit submit after we answered one question and didn't finish the rest of the quiz. According to a Facebook post on the Bushnell Prairie City Schools Facebook page, there's three things that students and parents should keep in mind while they are remote learning. Those being attendance, live instruction, and classwork is provided through Google Classroom. Hyde says the lessons are interactive, which helps her second and fourth graders learn. Put in um, pipe cleaner so we can make music notes with them. She says the lessons include art, music, and gym, along with core classes. Um, Emma last night did her music and she had got pool noodles. And you do the two pool noodles together, she cut them in half and you could make music with the pool noodles. Hyde says although an adjustment, she's happy her children's safety is top of mind. I do amend our school teachers and staff. There's a lot of extra work that's going in on their part. Kara Biernat, WGEM News, Bushnell, Illinois.